Hello and welcome back to Terror Hand, where today it is Groundhog Day. Not <laughs> got you there now, didn't I? I am playing tricks on you. No, um, it isn't Groundhog Day, but the day that it is today is Patch Day, and um, today's patch actually didn't change all that much, but it did introduce one very cool thing, at least. Well, I think it's cool, I think the idea behind it is great, and I'll show you what is new in this version. Look, wheelbarrows. Now, from what I understand, uh, these wheelbarrows make it so that gnomes who are dragging stuff around the castle um, can take multiple items now, instead of just like, well, one piece of dirt or meat or whatever they're hauling. They can now take multiple things, and I like it. So, uh, what we will do is uh, we will make a few of these wheelbarrows and see how they do. Because, um, well, you know, I think the idea is great, so uh, let's get some, right? I mean, four will do for now. I don't really know actually how many gnomes are hauling in our kingdom, so. But, um, that's that. Now, last time, when we finally got out of Groundhog Day, um, we did do some pretty cool things. Like, uh, if we take a look over here at Resurrected, for example, he himself got some very nice, spiffy, brand spanking new leather armor. And if you look over here, he only needs like four pieces, and uh, then he is completely covered. Which is good, because um, I want more of our military to get armor and stuff, you know, because I have a feeling that Mance won't be that far away from uh, Terror Hand anymore, so... Yeah, we need to start gearing up. Um, for the rest, what I also did was um, start some very cool mining operation down here, and that is amazing, because I hope to strike the mother load of, well, copper and gold and stuff, and uh, we have more chances the more down, uh, downwards we go. So, that's that. Um, what I want to do today is uh, more <laughs> of that. Well, at least I want to expand our mining operation a bit, but, um, I would think of it, um, you know, I kind of want to know, because, well, at the moment, wait, re no, <laughs> I wanted to click resurrected, come on, get over here. Yeah, look, at the moment, he's missing, like, four pieces, and I'm kind of curious, you know, like, how the rest is coming along, you know? Well, it seems that one piece is being worked on at the moment, which is a glove. Alright, um, interesting. Did I forgot something? No, boots, gloves, everything else should be made, I think. How is it possible that you miss four pieces while there is only three in the queue over here? Uh, <laughs> that boggles me, actually. I mean, the thing is, though, we got plenty of hides to build this. I guess it's the padding and stuff that needs a lot of work. Let's take a look at this padding. Whoa, <laughs> okay. So it needs a string and a bolt, bolt of cloth. And the string is made from bolts of cloth. Alright, yeah, I can see where this is going now. This needs quite a bit of work, so... We're actually not waiting for the... Um, uh, for the, you know, for Makita over here. But it's actually Jack the Clothier. That is like the bottleneck gnome in uh, our kingdom. So... Well, not much we can do about it. Oh, look, look, there he goes. <laughs> and he just grabbed some other piece of gear. Wow, cool stuff, man. All right, Resurrector, what do you got now? Oh, wait, it's his back. What can There's nothing I can put at his back, right? So, how on earth do we have, like, cloaks or something? I don't know, really. Anyway, um, yeah, we are... Ooh, look at that. Things are finished here. Now that's good, because um, I want to continue on building over here uh, in the compound, you know? Because right now it's like semi-operational. Sure, our military is over here guarding uh, stuff, but it's not functioning how I want. So, um, yeah, we'll continue over here and also at the mining operation, because damn, when we need that copper. We need it badly. In fact, um... Yeah, you know, seeing how it's like the third day of fall, and that is very good. 
You might ask, like, why damage? Why is it so good that it's the third day of fall? <laughs> well, I'll tell you. It is because that means that uh, a merchant is uh, close by, close by Terror Hand. And I heard that merchant was loaded up with the nice copper ore. All for us to grab, <laughs> to ninja away from him. Wow, we're gonna fair trade for it. But um, yeah, I know when that merchant, he is like kind of important for uh, our development. So what we need to do as well is um, open the gates. Because it's gonna be hard for that merchant to come into our castle if the gates are closed. Also, I think it wouldn't be such a bad idea if um, Resurrected got some, you know, sees that armor to use. Because right now, it is just way too new. <laughs> I mean, armor is there to be used. You know, have blood all over it and uh, stuff. And, um, well, right now, it hasn't any of that. Oh, whoa. Okay, so... We found ourselves some marble. <laughs> I mean, again, marble. There's marble over here too. What's this? Oh, that's <laughs> dirt floor. So, well, I mean, is it just only marble on this map? That would be quite weird, though, if it was. But because um, usually, you know, the previous kingdoms that I've played, we always had like granite on the map, and I never actually found marble. Well, now that's a bad thing or anything, I mean, <laughs> well, if I got to choose between <laughs> marble or granite, hell yeah, the choice is made pretty quickly, but you know, I just find it a bit weird that I don't seem to find any marble. Oh well. Who am I to complain, right? Uh, marble, I mean granite. You know, I expected to find a lot of granite, so... But no, we didn't. Anyway, um, right now, I think it's not such a bad idea to... Oh, where? All right. Um, no, I want this open. Come on, infect them. Open that up. <laughs> not. Well, I guess it's not such a bad thing if you start hauling over here. But I wanted other things done. Like, uh, how's our wheelbarrows coming along? Are they made already? Oh, we do have one wheelbarrow though. Ah, oh, look, and there it is. It is Heliolus who is using. Oh man, look at that. Alright, so what do you have with you? You're stocking items. Can I see, like... You got... Well, what, what's in there? Contents. One pine plank. Now, this is a bit of a menu. I mean, look. First, you need to select the gnome. <laughs> then, you need to go to his equipment. And, uh, well, you know, it's nice and hidden and tucked away in the interface. <laughs> but, yeah, here it is. Right now, he's only hauling off, like, one thing, but... What do you have now? Man, <laughs> I just keep checking him. Uh, contents. Oh, look, and now he's carrying two planks. I don't know what the limit is, really, but... Oh, 32. <gasps> wow. That is amazing. That is truly amazing. You know what? We're gonna, we're, we're gonna make a few more of these wheelbarrows, coming to think of it. Because, um, damn, man. <laughs> They're actually freaking good. Yeah, let's build, uh... Like, another... Two. Yeah. Wow, look at that. Wheelbarrows, man. We're making progress, and I like it. I like it a lot. Um, and this goes very fast, too. Alright, so a lot of things go very fast everywhere. You know, things get dug out, things get built, and, um, well, of course, I have my mind on the metals, um, but. You know, I want that building done too, so, yeah, um, let's see, I want three stairs over here. I know that there is these intermediary layers over here, and uh, I do plan to use them. It's just that I want to start at, like, minus seven with the mining. I mean, you can see over here that there's, like, a crap load of dirt. <laughs> well, there's only one thing in the terror hunt that we have an abundance of, and that's dirt. So, I kind of want to go as deep as we can safely go and then start mining, you know, to have the best chance of uh, striking gold. Uh, I mean copper, of course. So, that's why I'm going down first. And, um, it seems that it's a wise decision, as everything I decide is. 
<laughs> oh man, <laughs> I can't stop self-glorifying myself today. <laughs> really bad. Um, so, let's get like these two floor tiles out there. Good, then we should get some walls. I mean, the stair design isn't unique uh, for this, uh, you know, this compound. It's just that, well... I like it, you know. It's over. It's there too. A little bit different, but I like that design. So, um, also we should put a few more torches down over here. Now that we got like the grand stairway and stuff in there, we can start putting some definitive torches down. You know, torches that are very unlikely to be moved, like uh, these two over there. Alright, so you know what? I'll uh, speed a long time a bit, I guess. Um, well, actually, you see, I'm kind of working on two projects right now, and I'm just, you know, <laughs> afraid that if I do that, then uh, I'll get, like, you know, going up and down, forth and between all these uh, projects. So, maybe I won't speed up time. I mean, things go so fast now. My kingdom is so well organized. Let's see, is this in the center? It seems not, but I guess it is. Yeah, it is. Alright. Good. That also means that we can dig away the floors here. Over there. Yeah, alright. So, um, here's what I'll do. I'll, I will speed up time. So, um, yeah, let's do that. Wait, wait, hold on a second. Ho, ho, ho. Emperor damage. What on the freaking earth are you doing out here? You're building a soil floor? Really? Um, uh, but from where were you thinking? Oh, crap. Um, balls. <laughs> That's not good. I don't know, sometimes it just rotates really weird, you know. Uh, anyway, Emperor Damage, explain to me, from where do you think to build a floor? I don't know, I'm, I guess he must have gotten his pathfinding wrong. Oh, really? You went to grab dirt? That's... Oh, balls. Yeah, and that will happen again probably, uh, as long as they're building over there. Yeah, look at it. look at that! How bad is that? <laughs> I mean, all the magnificent advantages of our bridge working against us right now. Balls. Ah oh, well. Anyway, um, yeah. So, look at this. We got a stairways and the floor being built, and all of a sudden, this starts to look like a true military compound. Cause, um, well, you have to imagine yourself that these stairs will be gone once these are finished. We'll seal up this whole area. And uh, I guess that we will have stairs down to the basement, like over here. And uh, oh, you know what? I got a freaking cool idea all of a sudden. We'll have stairs down here at the side too. Hell yeah! And then we'll have pillars inside. Excuse me. Oh damn, man! I got so many cool ideas. So anyway, um, that's for over here. But I also want to know how the mining is going, because um, well, we're not. Whoa, look at that. It seems that this whole marble vein is expanding. Are we like... Yeah, look. We're below a mountain over here. Oh, well, <laughs> I mean, I say a mountain, but <laughs> this is no real mountain. I mean, these are like hills. They are real mountains in Omoria that go as high as this. <laughs> and this is high. Because <laughs> it's uh, depth 25. Um, anyway, yeah, so... I'm... We'll probably won't see marble everywhere at like minus seven, but we should see quite a lot of it. That's good though. Um, let's dig away some more stairs down here. Oh crap. 
Um, yes, one, three over there. Yeah, good. All right, so that should keep our gnomes busy. Um, also, what I'll do is um, I'll mine away the area around the stairs while well, we're at it. Uh, like that. In fact, we will also mine away the floor. Uh, just to, so it looks good. I mean, it, ma it might be I like I mine, but it does have to look good well as well. So, wait, hold on. <laughs> Did you saw that? They were standing like on each torch over here, <laughs> like true guards, you know? <laughs> wow, that's pretty cool actually. Yeah, I like that. Anyway, um, yeah, building over here is almost done, so we'll continue and um, I will speed up time again. That is after I check how the resurrected come out, come out wherever you are. Oh, there you are. Alright, so, resurrected soldier, how are you doing for equip- Oh my god, look at that. He only needs one boot. And that's it, really. I still have no clue what I can put on his back, though. Let's take a look. Maybe there's, like, something over here at the leather worker. No, at the moment there's nothing there. Maybe over here, the clothier. I mean, a cloak is usually made out of, you know, um, well... Fabric, uh, I guess I should put it. No, maybe <laughs> maybe we can equip a mattress <laughs> or a bandage and become like super gnome who can fly and stuff. No, it's probably not gonna happen. Though maybe <laughs> a metal cloak, <laughs> maybe. <laughs> no, I don't know what that back as equipment slot is for, but it seems to me though that resurrected is only missing one boot. Can I actually? Oh crap, can I actually see that? Uh, resurrected. Yeah, so you're missing like your right boot. Oh, look. Wow, now that is some nice attention to detail. Do you see these, <laughs> well, six pixels over here? That's his left boot. Over here is his right foot without a boot. <laughs> and that is some pretty cool detail, uh, I'll tell you. Because look over here, this is much brighter colored. There's a clear color difference over there. Wow. Even though the graphics aren't like, well, you know, up to snuff in terms of the era 2013. Those details, man, those are tiny minor details that I really like. That says a lot about the, uh, you know, the attention uh, and hard work put into this game. So, let's uh, get some stairs here and this time we will speed up for real. Alright, I think we just finished our staircase actually because they've broken through over here. That's pretty, pretty good actually. Um, we don't need to uh, dig away all this stuff over here and um, come to think of it, we are also doing the mining and there's still a little bit of digging that needs doing over here. So I'll temporarily, you know, do it myself. Just really temporarily. Well, I guess it's needed. So. Mining, oh man, the things I do for Terror Hand. <laughs> oh man. Um, yeah, so these stairs are now operational. I guess that does mean that we can safely deconstruct these temporary stairs. Finally. I mean, they uh, were so ugly to begin with anyway. And yeah, deconstruct that. Perfect. Wow, and then we can start building like the second floor over here. Get Med Bay out here. Well, or maybe a dining room. Or maybe both. Yeah, I think both would do. Good. Good, good. Look at that. Alright. Let's uh, speed time up some more. Great. So, both our miners are sleeping at the moment. <laughs> Perfect timing, lads. Oh, wait, no. Perfect timing, your highness. Damn it. <laughs> I mean, I need mining done more than ever now, and, uh, well, it's not getting done. 
Also, the sun is setting, the music is fading. I... No, no enemies. I thought enemies were about to spawn. Usually when the music goes low, you know, and quiet, then uh, enemies spawn, but not this time, though. Alright, so, Minus, could you please wake up? <laughs> I have work to do. Yeah, it seems I have, and it seems... No, I didn't go down there. I don't know, what am I doing? Help! Oh no, I'm gonna mine over here. Look, I knew it was me. I knew it all along. Alright, that's actually good, because if these floors are removed... Yeah, alright. So, now that things get done, I will uh, speed time up again. What do I see over here? A merchant has arrived. Wonderful news, I think. Oh, I hope. <laughs> um, merchant? <laughs> I hope you didn't die. Oh no, there you are. Alright, so he just spawned. The no merchant from Saw Branch. I think that's actually another kingdom than the one we had from last time. Maybe Saw Branch is richer. Maybe it lies under a mountain with bucket loads of copper in it. Uh, I sure hope so. So, yeah, let's slow this down a bit and um, welcome our merchant. Hi there, merchant. Come in, give me your goods. <laughs> you will get crap from us. <laughs> uh, no, not intentionally, of course, but whoa, hold on a second. Look at this. Just for one moment, I'm checking out the merchant and bam, everything gets done over here. That's good, actually. Now, um, down here. That means that everything's dug out? It does mean that. Alright, well, I'll um, assign some more build orders then for... Um, oh, come on. Crap. Alright. Yeah, these hotkeys, you know, they're not working once you've got uh, one window opened up, so... It's a bit finicky, but... Oh, well. Minor details, minor details. So, another room over there. And the merchant should be, like, somewhere close to getting in position now. I think that's you. What's your name? Oh, <laughs> you don't have any name. <laughs> your name is Gnome. <laughs> hmm. Alright, so there you are. Good. Let's trade. And first of all, I want to see what you brought to us. Is it worthy of our interest? That's a good question. A question that will be answered right now. So, whoa, yes, nice. <gasps> and you got tin. And you got, wow, I don't know. Wow, so it was just as I expected. This merchant has more worthful stuff. So, um, I want all of that, all of that, all of that, and all of that. And I need to somehow cough up a 1480 worth of kingdoms crap. <laughs> <laughs> so, we'll try and see if we can manage that. Wait, what? I have stuff lying around? Where's that? Alright, well, anyway, I'm not gonna trade that, but that is... We need to... In well, not investigate it, but I kind of do want to know where that is. So, um, alright, let's take a look over here. We got four superior clay statuettes. <laughs> That's not gonna bring us that far. However, that still doesn't bring us all that far. Maybe I should have started making a few of these uh, things I can trade. Because uh, <laughs> right now it's looking not so good, actually. Um, yeah, it's looking rather bad, actually, in terms of trading. Oh, crap. I should have prepared for this. I mean, we got Heliolus, what on earth were you doing? <laughs> well, not much. I know that much, but... Well, I don't want everything traded, but look at the freaking amount of seeds. I think if we keep like a hundred strawberry seeds, then we are still well covered. 
we keep like 200 of those, we're also well covered. Look, now we're getting somewhere. That's good. Yeah, look at that. We got way too many apple clippings too. If we only take like a hundred, you know, then we're good in terms of that. See, I can come up with a lot of crap all of a sudden. <laughs> and we got also, we got so many strawberries that, you know what, I'll, I think I'll trade a few of those. I'm not going to trade any more hides because we need them. And I'm not going to trade that, nor that. Oh, and we, wow, look at that. We actually got quite a bit of bread and sausage as well and stuff. I mean, I'm looking at it and <laughs> no, I'm actually thinking of trading it, but no, <laughs> just no, <laughs> I shouldn't do that. This I can trade though. Yeah, I'll trade that. I'll trade that too. Uh, I'll trade that too. All right. Uh, oh, we only need like 280 more. Ah, <gasps> oh, wow. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm just gonna trade a few of these strawberries. I mean, look, we got like freaking 930 food. We're making more food than we eat at the moment, and um, well, I think that means that we can trade off some of these strawberries to get all that ore. Because damn, man, <laughs> look at that. We can get, you know, we can actually start smelting bronze now, and I think we should. Why shouldn't we? I don't know. I kind of want, do want to equip everybody with weapons first, though. I guess we'll do that first, then. Now I'll leave the tin out there. Maybe I shouldn't... Yeah. Mm. Bronze, shinies, want. And then on the other hand... Yeah, it's all... Oh, man. Choices, choices. Very tough. Anyway, um, I'm not going to give him anything more than we can spare, because um, apparently I needed a little bit more of this crud, so... Um, let's see here. I need... How much do I need exactly? Oh man, <laughs> this is looking bad. Now, I think if I put in like this... Bam, exact. Alright, you know... As always, there is this tradition at Terror Hand where we give away a skull of our fallen enemies. I don't know if we have one at the moment. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, we do. Take this as a sign of a good deal. <laughs> well struck for our side this time. Because, um, well, I'm not giving away anything that we can't spare, you know, so... This is quite good. Um, I do like. Yeah, I think I'm making a solid deal over here. For the rest, I mean, now that we're looking at it, let's just take a quick look. Yeah, he doesn't have anything interesting besides the ores, really. I mean, I could, of course, take some of these, you know, these supplies, but no. No, alright. One, two, done. Alright. Good, so we got a freaking bucket load of ores now. <laughs> well, Cyber, I guess I, we, you won't be seeing the light of day for quite a while now, because then um, guess what? You got stuff to do. Um, alright, so... Any metal sliver. Alright. Um, well, I can't see for uh, any reason for us to keep ores, really. So what I'll do is I'll set this up to craft um, any copper bar. Yes craft any malachite bar yes and craft tin as well and I'm actually quite curious this malachite stuff you know I mean what is it I know malachites from World of Warcraft and they're gems <laughs> I mean they're no metals so I'm quite curious anyway um, that is quite good news man I mean the merchant was loaded rumors were true <laughs> I mean, I just made that whole load and merchant thing up, but <laughs> it did came true in the end, so that's quite good. And damn, man, we will uh, start equipping our gnomes with um, good stuff, finally. Wait, what are you doing? Cyber, alright. You are gonna... Well, what are you gonna do? You're gonna build a soil wall? How on the freaking earth can you build a soil wall... Oh, of course, you're gonna grab that dirt. Balls. Oh, man. There's one dirt over there that I don't like. 
Oh crap, now it's happening again. Balls. Come on, game, work with me here. Um, so if I rotate it like this, because I want to see how much more dirt, yeah, there's one more dirt thingy over there, right? That's one dirt clump. And over here, two dirt clumps, so... Cyber, oh, don't do anything foolish now, <laughs> I mean... Well, maybe, I wish I could, like, have a military guard a gnome, really. Don't do anything foolish now, Cyber. Really don't. And then BAM! <laughs> gnomes show up. Or uh, <laughs> goblins show up. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you're just gonna grab that dirt. Alright. Well, could have gone worse. Still can go a lot worse. Have like goblins spawn right over there. But they didn't. Alright, cyber is safe. That's all that counts. Actually, cyber, um, it's all nice that you're helping with this whole dirt shenanigan over here, but don't you get some armor to craft? Hmm? I'm not trying to suggest anything, but <laughs> stop building and <laughs> go and craft stuff. Oh, and this is actually another thing. Yeah, we, we're getting into this corner right here right now. Um, yeah, about that whole corner thing. How's the mining going down there? Let's take a look at that first. Alright, so that's just getting done like right now. Alright, um, in that case... Yeah. All right. Um, so what I will do, I will do only a few things, and then um, I'll call it a day. Hopefully not a Groundhog Day this time, but um, I'll call it a day and a good day for Terror Hand, I might add. Uh, yeah. Then we need these removed here. These ramps. Good. Once we got that done, really, then. We can really start, you know, with filling up this whole mad bay and uh, dining room. I mean, if we're gonna make like a dining room, how cool would it be if we would have like two windows over here? Or maybe over here, actually. I think that would be pretty slick now, wouldn't it? I think so as well. Yeah, so we'll incorporate a few windows. Cool. Alright, anyway, um, yeah, that's it. Join me next time when we will um, find out what... Uh, oh man, <laughs> I'm getting sidetracked here, but look at that. <laughs> it's the cook who is um, stocking items. Let's see. Uh, what do you got over there? Whoa, look at that. I mean, this wheelbarrow thing, man. Damn, that's good. It makes hauling, you know. All of a sudden, hauling can get done very quickly with all these wheelbarrows. This is amazing. Amazing. Alright, anyway, um, yeah, join me next time when we will um, continue on with mining the compound, gearing up our military, and hopefully some uh, of these um, never do well green skins show up, you know? Because, um, well, maybe, maybe they're actually getting a little bit afraid now, now that we got all these precious metals inside. Anyway, for the third and final time, join me then.